results from the weekend as at least put them close to leaders Juventus. Filippo Inzaghi making his first start in five months for Milan as he returns from an ankle injury and they certainly could use his services. Inzaghi into this match right away. Eighth minute lob from Kaká is to him, but he mistimes the jump. The ball falls to Marco Storari for the easy save. Inzaghi perhaps a little bit of rust to work off. Storari forced into action again midway through the frame. Andrea Perlo's free kick off his hands and luckily bounces over the bar. Kaká almost gets his leg on that one and Storari lucky on the play. Perlo turns provider 35th long ball to a breaking Inzaghi, but again the header lacks quality and Storari makes the cradle stop. Milan again close to the opener in the 41st. Kaká finds some open space and goes with the shot. But it's wide of the target and out behind Storari and Milan all over the promotion side in the late stages of the first half. Great look from up top on the replay as it drifts wide. It was scoreless at the restart and Messina probably happy at that. Milan gets the breakthrough they want in the 55th minute. Kaká with the corner kick to the back. Giuseppe Pancaro with the header that bounces past everyone and across the line for the opener. A maze of people, but Pancaro able to bounce it past a few pairs of legs and a diving Storari to give Milan the lead. Certainly deserve the goal, the hard work paying off. But Messina have shown themselves capable opponents. 45 seconds later, they're level. That's Domenico Giampa on goal. Cafu in chase, but he can't stop him in the shot. Low pass Nelson Dita. San Siro is stunned. Giampa blows right by Cafu and Maldini nowhere near the play. Scores rather easily. Messina proving to be a handful and certainly look like a side that's not about to give up very easily. They weren't finished either. Alessandro Parizzi with the long lob to Ricardo Zampagna. And he converts the header behind Dita, behind Maldini. And it's 2-1 to the Minnows. Look at the space for Zampagna to run into. And the Milan back line looking very unorganized. And they pay for it as Dita gets beaten once again. No more goals here as Messina come to the San Siro and take three points from AC Milan. Certainly not the result that many would have envisioned. Two run intact, having accumulated seven.